Since the rollout of the COVID-19 vaccinations, countries across Latin America have had problems obtaining AstraZeneca. Mexico had planned to begin bottling the vaccine in March, but months of setbacks at the Leomont Bottling Company, financed by billionaire Carlos Slim, delayed this distribution plan. Embajador Carlos. Foreign Minister Marcelo Ebrard, facing scrutiny for a Mexico City metro rail collapse built when he was mayor, this week announced that Mexico is ready to bottle AstraZeneca's COVID-19 vaccine. Granting access to many Latin American nations is big news. It's a step toward regional solidarity. Mexico and Argentina have been demanding that there be equity when it comes to access to the vaccine. Leading public health experts say this step by AstraZeneca could be a game changer in developing regions of the world, places like Latin America, where it could help distribution of the vaccine happen more quickly. Dr. Mauricio Rodriguez is a faculty member at the prestigious National Autonomous University's School of Medicine. He says this measure effectively breaks a global monopoly on production of the AstraZeneca vaccine. This project will allow for regional distribution. Now we can send vaccines to Guatemala, El Salvador, Honduras, and all of Central and South America. We can help each other as a region. We no longer need to wait for the vaccines to arrive from India. The World Health Organization called the equitable distribution of COVID-19 vaccines the challenge of our time. Mexico is now set to meet that challenge. Later this week, it will receive hundreds of thousands of AstraZeneca vaccines, which will be among the first to be bottled here. Frank Contreras, CGTN, Mexico City.